Hello and welcome to an unboxing. Now, I'm not sure of the camera angle straight, but whatever. It's balancing on the the desk, the worktop. I have tried. Found some blue tack in the process. Now, I'm a big fan of the Ghostbusters and um, have you seen some of my recent videos for like Wave of Illusion, um, The Mushroom Cloud from Hell and uh, Therapy Vinyl Unboxing. Um, I managed to get some money back from this internet company. And then a few things at work had went down. So we have got the Jaws box set, which obviously will be the next video. Um, poor Steve Bush Marshmallow Man, he's down and out. I don't think he made any announcers. Yeah. So it's definitely going to be a Ghostbusters display made in the new house. Um, there's a license plate to be on the wall for ages. That's my marker. Um, I'm doing it like this because I want to try and lay everything out. Although this looks a lot <laughs> bigger on camera. So, yeah. I got some space going here, but this is the limited edition Ghostbusters employee um, welcome kit. Um, it's limited only 300 in the world. The normal edition was about four pound cheaper, um, but since I was going in all this, the idea is to make these and make a display out of them, um, especially theme the house. Ghostbusters and Jaws will be two big priorities. Um, if anyone's watching for a while, um, might remember the um, was it the chess set I got. And uh, I literally never, ever, ever got around to unboxing it. I must have had it for about two years. I bought it at Forbidden Planet um, for about 20 quid. I ended up selling it for like 60 odd pound on eBay. I never opened it. So, But there, uh, this is mine. Um, so I'm just going to open these up dead carefully. Um, I'm not going to do the overlays. It's why I've went for this camera angle. Um, so let's just open these up. This is a nice, nice, ooh, see I thought that one's got to come off at the back, but yeah, we don't need that. It's, so yeah, it's Dr. Collector, um, it's a Sony Pictures, Columbia Pictures are on the back, um, employee manual kit, welcome to the Ghostbusters, a leading company in research and the physical big ass words of Dan Aykroyd's literature, there again on the back. Um, let's open it, oh. It's a lovely little box that. Right, so first up is a Certificate of Authenticity of the Paranormal, um, awarded to, I can obviously need to fill that in for my name on that. The above persons hereby authorized and empowered to perform function as Ghostbuster on behalf of the Ghostbusters Incorporated as a full member. So that's pretty cool. It's really nice, like quality that. Um, as I say, this should be designed for a print. So put that along there. So, wow, so that's what's different. So it's a black um, equipment and protocols. Um, um, I think it normally comes like a brown. That's what it is. That's really cool. Um, it's really nice and bossed. Ding, ding. Wow. So inside, mm -hmm. left my phone underneath the camera. This is number 19 of 300. Wow, it's pretty cool, like low 20s. Um, routines. So the protocol book. Um, so it's just it's just a manual guide, really. If you want to read a basic course. Oh, raise a cult. Look at that. That's a nice little hidden gem inside there. Um, yeah, that's really cool. Eh? So it's just giving you the general protocols. Um, Ghostbuster stuff's been quite um, popular for a while. Uh, the manual. Um, it's always been dead at pricey. Um, when you go on the Forbidden Planet, there you go, it's got the different suits, Core 2 protocols, um, the traps, the books, the slimer, uh, notes, how to switch the trap on. Trap's clean, it's a pretty big twinkie. Trap's just clean, so how to load the trap up, the ghost trap notes, just like you would do it if you worked at any. You know, like going on there and doing courses. Um, how to use the proton guns. Uh, Carl, my friend Carl, he's actually just brought one of the massive proton guns. A lot of extra notes in there. PKA meters and how they work. But yeah, jar, is that a jar of slime? <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that's really nice, that. So see, I mean, I'd, like if you bought a collection, I don't know where that's going to go. Um, right, next up in here, we've got... Ooh. This is never ever going to go back in the box properly, is it? Uh, Ghostbusters Echo One Routes and Accessibility, the service map in New York City with uh, the Stay Push Marshmallow Man on there. 
arm, it's pretty cool. Um, so that's, here you go, Carl. Uh, it's pretty cool. You cannot beat Ghostbusters on black. I mean, Blu-rays had blue. I think DVDs now got green slime on the background. You just can't beat the black of Ghostbusters logo. I believe this is a city map, actually. So there you go, opens up. Yeah, uh, Manhattan. Um, that's pretty fucking cool. Um, so it's got the River of Slime. It's a River of Slime. So you got Razor Cult there. Uh, you've got the monument, the Washington Monument that gets busted, uh, Ghostbusters um, Tower, um, must be the public library. So Dana Barrett's apartment is quite up in the top of Manhattan, mind. What have we got going on here? The Cedric Hotel, sorry about my phone. The Museum of Art, St. Paul's. So it's got the locations from the movies in there, as well as the Brooklyn Bridge. Video store ghost Chinatown spook. That's ah, really really cool. That it's really cool. It's got the high and fret levels, shows you the, like, the level of river slime. So it's pretty really cool. Ah, oh, so that's awesome. So I've got room there, right? There, lay my fingers out. Next up, a little patch of the spook. That's really cool. A rookie, a rookie badge. So you're the rookie. Ghostbusters 2. This is really cool. It's very high quality. I mean, look at this, man. An official calling card. Um, are you going to call? So I'll put that down a bit there. I've got an official pen. Do you do, do do? Property protected by the Ghostbusters. So you've got a sticker. Oh, wow, look at that. You've got an official advert clipping. Like a flyer. <laughs> oh, poor Eddie Hudson. Been cut off that bugger as well. 555 Wow. Call the professionals. So we'll lay all the stuff out there. Oh, how did we do today? It's an invoice. I do that, man. That's pretty cool, lad. So, I mean, if you're framing this, you could sort of put, like, your name on there, what you've invoiced for. I mean, I might invoice Paul Ray. You know, like, right, Paul, you owe me some cash. You know, he's you definitely have to clean up his ectoplasm after you've seen this. Like, get them walls cleaned. Um, so that's really, really cool as well. And I think it's even carbonated paper. It is. So, I mean, that is absolutely awesome. Um, let's see along the echo. That didn't come with this, by the way. That's been around there for a while. Um, so we've got an official um, metal um, employees welcome kit that's pretty mad because I mean you would think that would have the number on if they were going to that extent of the books being numbered but it doesn't um, it's just merely another seal of authenticity that get there with my pen um, I think I might need that last um, here you are look at that look at that cheap debt with that yeah look at that yeah. So I've got a little container. I thought that actually had slime in it. It's pictured with slime. Hmm. Yeah. So well, again, let's go around to Paul Ray. She have yeah, I've just I don't I'm gonna have to go around the supermarket now, on to Great. Well, that looks all right. Going down the shower gel aisle. Fill the mammal film. So that that's probably gonna be my outtake to be honest with you, unless I find some in the bathroom. No, that's not much now left in this house. So yeah, um so the Ghostbusters one. As I say, there's a, I think there's a little bit less than I thought in there because of the box, but um as I say, I get myself a frame. Maybe just do a little mashup, you know what I mean, by the time you actually take the map and put that into the pack really you kinda you kind of go down with the town with that one but these um as i say they were quite cheap and um, they were expensive quite a while it's pretty cool that they have got like the authenticity and that and you know go i mean if you talk about ghostbusters on the channel and uh, me and paul ray the movie pop guy we've sat and done both ghostbusters um podcast it was our first joint one and we've done over 30 now together so you know um uh, ghostbusters you can relate to so many people um everyone we should have already had afterlife by now but unfortunately we're still waiting on that um but yeah what a nice little pack i can put them upside down 
But yeah, we'll see you in the outtakes. So a quick outtake for the Ghostbusters. Um, I've got nothing in the house for ectoplasm, but I'm also won't have time to do anything. I've got the moon shower gel, the moon's dark purple. It doesn't really look like the ooze, so I will find some of that for when it gets displayed. I have filled in it that it's me. Stephen Mason on that. And last but not least, it's an invoice for Paul Ray's VHS. So I filled in his address, his phone number, and this is his invoice. Okay, so one spooky call out after 12 o'clock, £350. Two full ectoplasm clean downs. Oh, I told you. Um, that was, well, mates rates really for that. £500, so times two was a grand for that. Uh, one trap concealment, so that's 750 That's standard rates for that. You want some Ghostbuster towels, so you want two Ghostbuster towels. Uh, that's £100 for both of them. 24-hour aftercare. Um, if he might be the guy ringing up, breathing deep down the telephone, I'm not too sure. Might get on the top of that. Might be a Matt Davies as well. Um, one Ghostbuster lollipop. Um, kept them going. and Toad and Spirit Guide as well, which everyone should have when they've encountered a ghoulie. So yeah, his total invoice plus uh, tax rate of 17% was 2,917 pounds, which I'm now waiting on. So yeah, Carbon copied it. So yeah, two of them, Paul Ray. Yeah, these are awesome, absolutely awesome. Check it out down the line when I get it framed up as well. But yes, and it was a little bit of a bugger. Oh, we forgot it. To put back in the box and to the trap where it goes. Thanks for watching. Goodbye for now. Give us your money. You owe some money. Whoa, 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 whoa. You owe whoa. some I'm money. I'm the invoice. You're for the ghosts. How for, much? For ectoplasm. No, no, the ectoplasm.